Hey, what up, legends? How's it going? It's your boy Kiwi and Bacon. I, today, I got something pretty cool for you, but in the meantime, I, before we get into anything, I'm giving away a pre purchase of the brand new expansion, Kobolds and Catacombs, once the channel reaches 7,500 subs. If you want to participate, it's there for you. I'm going to put some in, you know, information about that in the description. And today, we're going to be playing a sweet, sweet Paladin deck that was created by one of my favorite deck creators, Kaiselcap. Uh, I'm going to put a link to the deck on Heartpawn in the description also, so you guys can go check that out. But uh, basically, well, it's, um, it's a Taldoran Paladin. Um, and it runs a lot of good stuff. You see your hand buff, Taldoran Paladin. Um, so you have Grimstreet Enforcers, you've got, um, you've got your Smuggler's Run, and well, of course, you have Prince Kelaset, Prince Taldoran, and you're hoping to get that beautiful, uh, Prince Kelaset on turn two, and then perhaps Prince Taldoran a little bit, you know, a little bit later in the game, so you can actually, uh, copy something along the lines of a, a Grim Street Enforcer or perhaps a Cobalt Scale Bane or, or something of the sort. Or or perhaps even Leroy Jenkins since Leroy is in here. I'm going to give this deck a try. Hopefully you guys enjoy. If you do, there's a like button somewhere on the video down there. And uh, also go go on Harpon and make sure to upvote uh, Kieselcap because he makes fantastic decks. Um, and he deserves all the recognition he can get with this. Okay, so now the fun part starts. We have Taldoram. But the cool thing about Taldoram is that you want to play it on something that has extra value, like Enforcer or Scalebane. So, that's what we're going to try to do. It, it's pretty difficult. Uh, we're playing against the quest mage though. That that'll be interesting. We can also get some some value out of Leroy. So we can play for eight uh, Leroy and and Talaram and uh, get like nine damage. It's not good. But but is there? Oh, okay. We have the we have the good opening hand here. That is crazy. <laughs> okay, so Keleset and then Taldoram. We're probably going to play on, on Scalebane. Okay, I'm going to Argent Squire. The light protects me. Okay. Hero power. Okay, Ice Barrier is fine with me. Next turn is going to be Coin into Scalebane. And then the turn afterwards is going to be something into Prince Taldoram. For sure. Like, there's just no way I don't do that. I hope you like my invention. Okay, cool. Okay, sounds good. Coin. Cobalt. I'm gonna trade here. I'm gonna trade here. And I'm gonna go face for some beautiful face damage. Please attack. P please put the attack here. Yes. Alright, sweet. And then Taldoram on the Cobalt Scale Bane gives you so much value. An incredible okay. Story. Simulacrum. Okay. So Taldoram on here. And then we're going to Blood Sail. Attack here. We attack here. And then let's go face. I'm gonna keep the, the fire actually no, I can I can play the firefly. <laughs> this is fine. Okay. Okay, sounds good to me. That's a great board. Now he, he's probably gonna have some board clears. He's probably gonna have some board clears. I like the fact that this has a Divine Shield, so even if you me Meteor somewhere, this is still okay. I do not mind this. Ooh, and the Cult Master. I'm going to play Cult Master on here. So if he kills stuff, 
and everything gets buffed. I'm all I'm all right with that. Oh come on! Both on the silver hand. This this silver hand recruit is gonna die. No. If he has flame strike though. Actually, if he does have flame strike, this is not such a good position to be in. Okay. Do you have to? Yes. Okay. That's what I was going to say. Like, you have to do that. Okay, so I'm going to play Bone Mare on this guy to protect him. Kill this. And then, wait. Then we kind of have to go face. Unfortunately, I have to pop him at 5. Which I can't really do anything about, though. Oh, damn. <laughs> Hi, Argent Squire. How you doing? That's a big squire. I mean, I still have Leroy. So even, even if he board clears and everything, I still have Leroy. This is good. Oh, hi. Okay, he's gonna try some shenanigans. He he knows he's sort of screwed. Okay. And and then and then that's pretty much it, right? All right, fair enough. Good good good, good job. <laughs> oh, the Taldoram! So much damage was given during this game. I like it. That was a lot of fun. That was that actually was pretty damn great. I'm I'm, <laughs> I'm so happy that that actually worked. Okay, let's let's keep going here. Taldoram is the new Keliseth. Uh, maybe not. You still need both, which is kind of hard to play with um, because you have all of your one drops, all of your four drops, but like in the meantime, there's like a gap void of like nothingness, and if you don't get anything, well, you're kind of screwed. Um, and it's really hard against classes that have a lot of tempo because you're delaying your value for later in the game. So, yeah, I mean... I don't need any of those cards. We drew patches, right? Okay. Okay. That's not good. Firefly. Alright, hi, Firefly. Ooh, ta well, that's Taldoram. Okay, well, I'm gonna... Okay, I'm gonna Argent Squire. I'm gonna Coin. I'm gonna other Argent Squire. This is pretty... This is pretty stupid. I wish I had Keliseth instead. Yo, I could turn Kel... I could turn Taldoram into a... Uh... Oh, yeah. That sounds like a great deal. Actually, yes, that's what I want to do. I want to turn Taldoram into a 3-3 Premofin totem. Or actually, or 3-3 patches and trade here. Actually, I think 3-3 patches is probably the better deal. Let's be honest here. a 3-3 three, three for 3 with charge. <laughs> it doesn't really do much, but it's there for you when you need to kill something. No, oh, right. Okay. Cool. Um, oh, Chain Gang. That's pretty decent. Let's pass. And then next turn, maybe Gram Street? I prefer playing Grim Street before Doppelgangster because Doppelgangster gets some extra value that way. No. Oh. oh! Yo, I still got Mukla. That's good. That's actually really good. I like that. Trade the 5. The 5-5. Five, five. Did he just not attack with the 5-5? Five five? Is it just me, or did he forget to attack with that? 
Because if he did... That's just too bad for him. Alright. No more patches, unfortunately. Though if he does have a weapon, I can destroy it with the Blood Cell Corsair. Bone Mare is there. Chain Gang's there. He can't kill it, can he? This lives an next. This lives an extra turn. That's awesome. Okay, I'll play the. I'll play the. I'll play this. Oh uh, yes, extra stats. I love this. No, this is a. This is three four four for five. That's really good. Kinda wish I had like a blessing of kings on there. Trade. Trade. Yep. Trade. That's fine. Alright, here it is. Womp. Okay, so now I've got a 7-7 Bone Mare, which is pretty hard for him to kill. I have another Bone Mare. Come on. Actually, ooh, okay. This ain't too bad. Okay, I think I'm going to play Double Gangsters here. Is that trade here? And then Double Gangsters. Firefly Hero Power. Now I've got a big board, which is good. And he does not. That's also a good one. Thank you for buffing a good minion. It's better than if you buff the Silver Hand Recruit. Yes. All of a sudden... Ooh, okay, hi. Evolve. Okay. I'm going to try to derive some value off of this. Okay, so I'm going to trade... Wait, okay, I've got to trade there first. Okay, no, I'm going to trade here. I'm going to kill this. Right. I'm going to Bone Mare on this. Right here. Kill this. Alright. Kill this. Kill this. Um, and, uh, Hero Power. Kill this. And I still have, I still have a board. So, uh, whatever we did here was pretty good. Awesome. I mean, it's not the best board ever. Oh. Ouch. That actually hurts. I mean, I still have the Grim Street Enforcer. Which I'll play with nothing else. I'll just do it like this. Remove all of his board. And just start generating extra value. We get a Yeti Blood Cell Corsair for one. That's, that's pretty crazy. No. Okay. Hi. <laughs> That's just unfortunate. Let's go Blessing of Kings. Alright, let's just go all in with this for now. Since, uh... Since he killed or Enforcer there. I actually really like playing Taldoram on patches. Um, it's just... It just gives you an extra little boost, you know? Like, if, if, if patches lives. Um, you just get like an, a little extra boost of burst at the beginning of the game. Just trade a minion really easily. Uh, three, three, three charge for three is pretty good. Um, all right, sweet. There you go. So this was the Taldoram, um, the Taldoram hand buff paladin. Um, it's 
It's so much fun. I don't say... I, okay, I'm not saying craft Taldoram because he's a good card. I'm just saying if you happen to have Taldoram, try this deck out. It's a lot of fun. That's pretty much it for me today. Thanks a lot for watching, of course, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye. <laughs>